A threat to Waukesha West High School for school leaders and law enforcement to conduct a staggered evacuation of the building today. Parents and students say the community is already going through so much after the recent Christmas parade tragedy. Fox 6's Angelica Sanchez joins us live outside the school with an update on the investigation. They made all the kids stay in their class and then the police like showed up. Waukesha West student tells Fox 6 what it was like inside the high school upon learning of a threat to students. There's already a lot of other stuff going on in Waukesha, so I don't, I'm just hoping nothing else happens and yeah, just praying that everything stays okay. Many students wore jerseys to show support for the youngest of the six people killed in the recent Christmas parade tragedy. He was laid to rest Friday. The threat to students is also coming on the heels of the deadly high school shooting in the state of Michigan. We'll wait till my daughter comes to, to me. One parent tells us how she learned of the threat. My daughter actually was in the restroom at the time of the lockdown, um, and um, she had texted me saying there is a sudden lockdown. Um, in place and that um, she feels scared. The staggered evacuation started with students who drive, followed by students who ride the bus. Shortly after, hundreds of vehicles lined up to pick up students. Waukesha police assisted with traffic control. He wore a jersey today to school. Um, so that was on my mind this morning. Parents, understandably anxious to see their children. I'll just give them a big hug when I see them. Now we've also learned that police responding to Waukesha West had to respond to Waukesha South because there was a fight with students that required police intervention. We know classes will resume on Monday at Waukesha West. Reporting in Waukesha, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News.